Hi there, this is Sunny Sniper, and in today's video I'll be giving you all the tips and tricks I know about using the Chernobog to help you become an expert Chernobog user. First thing I will show is how to access one of the best Chernobog spawns on the map, straight from the Maze Bank office. So it's right here on the map. You stand right next to this yellow barrier. Call my mechanic. Call on the channel bog and make sure you stay looking at the ground. Sometimes it will spawn over here and sometimes it will spawn on the other side of the road but it's then very easy just to drive right round. So when driving into this spot, make sure that you block off the front door before putting it into lockdown mode. This allows you to spawn straight in like this, and instead of holding triangle to get into the gunner seat, you now need to press triangle to get into the gunner seat. Once your Chernobog is in position, make sure that you stay outside your Chernobog when you're not using it. This is because when you're in your Chernobog, you will display this map icon. And it also means that people can't lock on missiles to you. Now that your Chernobog is in position, use your pause menu map to look for potential targets. If you see a target potentially coming in range soon, get ready by getting into your Chernobog, look in the direction they may be, and then pausing. This means that you'll be ready in your Chernobog, but they'll still have no idea you're in one. As you can see what I did there, taking down that MK2 is that he was coming very close within range so I only fired one or two missiles. You don't need to fire the whole barrage to take down an MK2. MK2s are the easiest targets to take down. You literally only need one missile theoretically to take them down. As you can see. If there are multiple targets on the map, or you think that your position has been compromised, now is the time to ghost. Chernobog can actually lock onto targets through buildings and walls. As you can see here, I'm tracking this person a very long way away through buildings. Wait, where is he? There he is. and that's a confirmed hit. Another way to make sure people don't know you're in a Chernobog is actually to get a friend to set a bounty on you because when you have a bounty on you, you only display a bounty icon. You do not display a Chernobog icon. Another tip, even though I'm about to call off the cops, the cops cannot harm you while you're within the Chernobog. So even though they are annoying, you do not need to worry about them. Okay, so you're in serious trouble, and you need my help. Okay, okay. Another tip. If you're worried about getting bad sports, launch the job Headhunter. Not only will this stop you getting bad sport points, but it will hide your icon on the map, so people will not know you're a Chernobog. You will have a target on you, but they will not know that you're a Chernobog. One tactic that can help you have a better chance of shooting down a jet that's performing evasive maneuvers is to spread out the missiles that you are firing like I do in this clip. This is because it gives a better chance of one of the missiles cutting off the jet within its evasive circle.
Another tip is to always make sure that you have the free mode event Hunt the Beast turned on. This is because if you get chosen as the beast, you become off the radar for 30 minutes with a massive health and speed boost. And even when you do very occasionally appear on the map for being stationary in your Chernobog, they will not know that you're in a Chernobog because you will display the beast icon. To make sure this is turned on, go to your interaction menu, go to hide options, go to events, and then make sure Hunts the Beast is on show. I think the most important tip to getting good with the Chernobog is simply lots of practice. It is a very situational vehicle, so if you pick your moments right, you'll be picking up some very nice kills with the Chernobog in no time. My previous two videos are also on the Chernobog, so do check them out if this is the first one you've seen. The rest of this video will be some sweet Chernobog kills, so thank you so much for listening, and I hope this video was helpful to you.